Good morning. Today we are in Round Rock Lodge number 227. Here in Texas. We got some event here going on today. This is the lodge. Very nice structures. Welcome to Round Rock, Lodge number 227. Nice, huh? Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Now I'm going to start right here. Say hi, Brother Don. Hi, Brother Don. <laughs> <laughs> the best place in the lodge, dining room. Yes. Bro. What's up, Nick? You still going today, bro? We are already here. Oh, man. Tell him, tell him, uh, if you can curve and tell him he is Gordon, we're running a little late, but we're going to be there right before nine. Okay. All right. He's here, too. He's, uh, he ain't not much people here. Just me and uh, one uh, worship over here, and Brother Curvin is the one that opened the lodge about five minutes ago. Awesome. All right. Okay, I, I got Brother Don with me too. Don? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, no. <laughs> Don, he's happy to hear that you're here. <laughs> Since we're still close. Mm -hmm.
addition to the qualification for a C certificate, each of these brothers have learned the following. Uh, and uh, the grand, uh, grandmaster has put down there what all they have to learn. But, but they have to learn how to open and close all the lodges. They have to learn all the questions and answers as did the C. And, and uh, they also have to know how to do the work in all three groups. That's your key statistics. And so on behalf of the Most Worshipful Grand Lodge, Grand Master, Brother Red Billings, and the members of the Grand Lodge of the Texas Committee on Work, it is my distinct honor and privilege to present to you, you brethren, your Grand Lodge of Texas Ritual Certificates. Okay, Brother Pitts. He is a member of, uh, of uh, Liberty Hill Lodge. And Brother Nunez is a member of Lawrence Lodge. And uh, congratulations to you too, brother. And uh, Brother Nunez, he, he calls me every once in a while when he needs a lecture done, and I'm always happy to go up there and do it for him. And that's good to see you, you bringing all those brothers from up there. And uh, maybe all of them now want to get a certificate. They're hungry for it. Bless the altar. You're still Jason Mid, right? Uh, yeah, my brother, uh, Jason's in the house. I'm James. James. I'm the younger brother. How do you, how do you, how do you pronounce your first name? Dexter. Dexter. I don't have your number. I got a new phone. So. Now, so these guys all receive an A, and they have, they have to learn everything. All, everything that the C learned, everything that the B had to learn. In addition, they have to know the lectures. And uh, Brother Michael there, I sat next to him when he got his first A certificate over in Georgetown. And, uh, and he's done it ever since, so uh, that, that's great. So anyway, brethren, uh, on, be let's see here. on behalf of the most, most worshipful Grand Master, Brad Billings, and the members of the Grand Lodge of Texas Committee on Work, it is my distinct honor and privilege to present to you your Grand Lodge of Texas Ritual Certificates. Okay. Mm -hmm. Brother Michael Grubbs, right worshipful Grubbs. There you go. Uh, Brother Vic Armstrong, Jim here. Brother, uh, Brother Gene Eves gets two certificates, one from Liberty Hill and one from Leanne. Yes, sir. Here's your students. Thank you very much. You only get one pen. Only one pen. <laughs> Brother Michael Gibney receives two. And they are also Leander and Liberty Hill. Are you still in Fogelville? Mm -hmm. Yeah, just down the road. Brother Shane, you with you. Uh, Brother Victor, I'm so happy to see you finally get a certificate. It's been a long time. It's been a long time coming. It's like a year. Brother Gibney, thank you so much for all your 
And I know Brother Gibney and Brother Eves here are responsible for, there's a couple of bees that uh, uh, got certificates too, responsible for them learning this work. And brother, that's a good example for all you lodgers to, to get some of your younger members to uh, learn some of their work. Because we're all getting old. I'm 81 years old and, and I'm not gonna be around forever. And so we gotta have some young people. of 